Hello everybody, so welcome back to our English class again. It's nice to see you, okay. How are you today? Are you fine? Yes, and I hope you, I hope everybody also fine like me, okay. So, for today, I'm here, I'm going to teach all of you the lesson. But, before I'm going to continue our new lesson, I want to remind you something. How many words that we already learned the last the last video yes so today what day is today today is tuesday right yes so what kinds of book that we need to study for today today we need to study about yes about this book for name right yes okay so i want to read you all of you something about some vocabulary that the teacher gave you last week Okay, so everybody, let's take a look all together. Yes. You know how to pronounce these kinds of letter? You know how to pronounce? This word we pronounce est. Est, right? Okay. And how about the second one? How do we pronounce? Egg. Egg, right? Okay, so let's repeat after me all together. Egg, egg, est, est. Okay, very good. Yes. So now everybody, let's take a look on the whiteboard. I will remind you something about some vocabulary. Okay. How many words are there on the whiteboard? There are. There are only only ten words. Yes. From from the next, sorry, uh, from the video last week, we already learned there are 18 words. But today, I'm just, I only pick up some, some 10 words for all of you, okay. You know, number one, you know how to pronounce this word? This word, we pronounce West, West, right? West, okay. Verb est west, right? Yes. Second, nest, 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 and n s nest. Okay. Number three, test, 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 t t s. Test. Number four. Pest. Pest. P. P. S. Pest. Five. Best. 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 B. B. S. Best. Okay. So. How about this one, everybody? You know how to pronounce? Egg, right? Okay, so let's read all together with the term. Check, check, C, check, egg, check, right? Okay. Move to the second one. Neck, neck, N, N, egg, neck. Okay. H, T, T, egg. Deck, deck, peck, peck. Okay, very good. 
So after we finish our reading, I want to ask you about spelling. Okay. Everybody, you know how to spell the word West? How do we spell the word West? West I spell W E S T. Okay? Are you right? Very good. This word we call West. Okay. You know how to spell the word? The word nest. Nest I spell N E S T. Right? Very good. You know how to spell test? Test I spell T E S T. Test. Very good. For pest. Pest I spell P E S T. Yes. Five. Best. Best. Best I spell B E S T. Best. Check. Check. I spell C A E C K. Check. Very good. Neck. Neck. N E C K. Right. Neck. Check. T E C K. Very good.
bell, bell. Seven, cell, cell. Eight, smell, smell. Nine, fell, fell. Ten, cell, cell. Okay, everybody, let's read one more time with the teacher all together. Number one. Number two, number three, number four, number five, number six, number seven, number eight, number nine. Number ten. Okay. Yes. Uh, so now I will explain all of you about the meaning of the word. Okay. Number one. Ten. Ten. Ten is refer to number ten. For example, I have ten ten dogs. I have ten ten rulers. I have ten ten markers. Okay. I have ten. I have ten books. Yes. Number two, pen. Pen. Pen mean is refer to kinds of material that we use in the classroom, and we also can use pen to write the letter or to draw some picture. Yes. Here. Okay. How many pen do you have, student? Okay. What kind of pen that you have? You have red pen, you have black pen, or you have blue pen. Okay. Number three, pen. Pen. Pen is referred to lady, lady chicken. Okay, chicken. Here you can see as a picture. This one is the picture of the word of the word hand. Very good. Number four, bag. Bag. Bag mean, sorry, bag. The definition of the word bag mean to request something from someone. Yes, to request something from someone. For example, you request some money from your mother, or you request some some help from your friend, something like that. And this one is. Uh, refer to bag. Bag. Five. Eight. Eight. Here is the picture of the word of the word age. Means something that you can eat, and age has two color. It has uh, for inside of the age we have uh, orange, and outside here have white color. Okay. Have you ever eat age before, everybody? Yes. Number six, bell. Bell. I told you already. A uh, bell is refer to something that remind all of you what time that we need to go to study in the class and what time that we need to go back home. Okay, bell. Number seven, cell. Cell. Cell is the kinds of seafood. Seafood. Yes. Um, it's blue in in the sea. Yes. Eight, smell, smell, smell means to get air by by nose. Okay, when you, for example, when your mother is cooking in the kitchen and you will smell some some food from from the chicken, from the kitchen. Sorry. Okay, smell. Number nine, fell, fell, fell is. To to bring down or to the ground, yes. Mean, for example, this ruler is fell fell down, yes. It's falling down, falling down, something like that. Ten cell cell. The word the opposite of the word cell is mean buy buy, yes. For example, I sell I sell some vegetable and you buy. You buy 
some vegetable ball from, from me. Yes, something like that. Sell. Sell is opposite the word buy. Very good. Okay, so now everybody, let's move to our sentences all together. Number one. Number one. The age smell, smell bad. Smell bad. You know smell bad, smell bad? Mean, hey, something that smell not too good. The age smell, smell bad. Number two. Do they smell cells? Again. Do they sell? They sell cells. Sorry. Do they sell cells? No smell cell. Yeah. Number three. She buys ten hands. She buys ten hands. Okay. Yeah. So let's. I want to make sure that you understand what is the meaning of the vocabulary, and I will ask you. Okay, everybody. What is the definition of the word number 10 in Khmer? Min, Le, Le Ta. Yes. Number two. Okay. Number two. Pen. 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 Here. He is. He is pen. Min, but Yes. Number three. Pen. 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 In Khmer, Min, Mon. Money. Yes. Four. Back. Back. In Khmer mean som rikos na som. Yes. Five. H. A mean sop. Yes. Six. Bell. Bell. Kondam. Seven. Cell. Cell mean Min some box chong, rico some box chan, yes. Eight smell, smell, smell in my min hut hut. Nine fell, fell min to bring down, to bring down min, you know, clear, clear job, yes. Ten cell, cell. In Khmer, look. Yes. Okay. So now everybody, let's read with me all together one more time and spell the word. Ten. Ten I spell T-E-N. Ten. Two. Pen. Pen I spell P-E-N. Three. Pen. Pen I spell A-E-N. Four. Back. Back I spell B-E-G. Five, eight, eight I spell E G G. Number six, bell, bell I spell B E L L. Or you can say B E double double L. Cell, cell I spell S A E L L. Cell. Eight, smell, smell I spell S M E L L. Nine. Fell. Fell I spell F E L L. Ten. Cell. Cell I spell S E L L. Okay. Okay, move to sentence again. One. The age smell bad. Two. Do they sell cells? Three. She buys ten hands. Okay. Okay, I hope when, when you stay at home, I want all of you to create by your own sentence by using this word below and try to make sure that your sentence is correct and it's easy for you to create by yourself. Okay, so now everybody, that's all for our, our new lesson and I will let you do some exercise on the textbook. Okay, everybody, so now let's start to our exercise all together, yes. So, please open your textbook on page 36, yeah. And you will see, here is your exercise, and they want you to do is to circle the rhyming picture and track the rhyming words, yes. 
And please take a look on the whiteboard all together and I will explain you how to do exercise, okay? Yes, let's pay attention. Here, rhyming word. Yes, as I told you, I told you already, okay? What is rhyming words? Rhyming word is refer to the words that has the same that has the same sound. Yes, very good. Yes, for this exercise, they want you to circle rhyming picture and try the rhyming words. Yes. Let's see. How many vocabulary are there on the whiteboard? Let's count all together. One, two, three, four, five, six. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. There are, there are 12 vocabulary, okay? Yeah. So now, please, I will give you one example and I will let you do it by yourself and look at me all together. Here, rhyming word. You see? You know how to pronounce this word, everybody? This word. Man, man, right? Yes. And how about this one? Hand, west, west, again, west, west. Okay, so what are the ranking words? Can you tell me what are they? They are, they are man, west, or man, and hand. Yes, it must be, it must be man. M and hand. Yes, you need to circle this one. This one is the correct, correct answer. You need to circle man, and and hand. Yes. And for number two until number four, you need to do like this. Okay. So I give you one or two, three minutes to do it by yourself. Okay. And I will back and I will correct all of you. Okay, now everybody, let's check our home, sorry, our exercise all together, okay? What is the correct answer? Yes. So let's start from number two. Number two, what, what are the correct answer? Okay. I just correct for all of you. The correct answer is, wait, but I want to ask you first, how do we read this word? This word we read H, H, right? And how about this one? Bat, right? Leg, leg, leg. Okay. So the correct answer is H and leg. Very good. Three. Smell, bell, seal, right? Okay. So the correct answer, smell and bell. Very good. Are you right? Okay, so move to the last one all together. Sell. Ship. Fell. Again. Shell. Ship. Fell. Okay, what is the correct answer? Yeah, it must be. It must be sell. And fell. Right? Okay, everybody, are you correct? Are you correct? Okay, I hope you can do it all together with the correct answer. Very good. So now, please, after we finish our exercise, I will give you our homework for today. Okay. Okay, everybody. So now let's move to our homework all together. Yes. But before we are going to know how many homeworks and how to do your homework i want to explain or remind you something about vocabulary that we learn that we learn for the moment yes so now let's read this word all together yes hand again hand hand pen pen h h Ten, ten. Fell, fell. Sell, sell. Bake, bake. Sell, sell. Bell, bell. 
Lake, lake. Okay. So I hope you, when you stay at home, you need to read it again and again to make sure that you can read very well. And one more thing, don't forget to try to spell this word all together. Okay. So now go to homework all together, everybody, and look at the whiteboard. Okay. There are two homeworks for you for today. Okay. So let's start from the first homework. Here, they want you to unscramble the words below. Yes, there are five, five words that they want you to unscramble. Yes, they want you to rewrite this word into the correct, correct words. For example, E, B, G. So what is the right answer and what is the correct word? Yes, and I will give you one example. Okay, the correct answer is B, E, G, right? Okay. How you how to pronounce this word? Back, back, right? Yes. And from number one, number two, until number five, they want you to do like this. Rewrite this word into the correct, correct words. Yes. And move to the second one. You can see here is the instruction of our homework. Make sentences by using the words. Okay. Such as hand, leg, bell, ten, and pen. Yes. So I give you one example by using this word to create by your own sentence. Yes. Yeah. Let's see all together. I will choose the word. I will choose the word ten. Yes. For example, she has. Ten, ten words. Ten books. Yeah, very good. Okay. She has ten books. She has ten books. Okay. So all of you, you need to use this word to create your own sentence. Okay. Yeah. So don't forget to do your homework. Yeah. 